It is January 2023. I am sitting at my desk on a Friday evening. At the time, I was living in a city, so the whole city was partying and going out. But not me. In front of me lays a journal. Because I had just written down what's bothering me. I had written down my thoughts. Because the people online, they said it was good for me. And so I did. But I looked at the paper and all I could see on that paper was me being angry at myself. Being mad at myself. Saying that I was a failure. Saying that I would never make it. That I wasn't worthy. That I couldn't do shit. I had no one to talk with about this. Even though I was living in this vibrant city. I had basically no friends. Sure, I had some from the time that I was smoking weed and drinking alcohol, but I didn't really want to meet up with them anymore because well, I don't want to fall back into those old, old habits, right? I felt miserable. Days went by, weeks even, and every day, almost every day, I would write down these negative thoughts of myself. But after that, I would go back to watching YouTube, watching porn, eating junk food. Then there came this one evening, a few weeks later, when I tried to look at things positively. I thought I'd give it a try. What did I accomplish so far? I thought it was nothing, but I started writing. I was consistent in meditating every day. I took a cold shower every day. I've quit a lot of bad habits, drinking, smoking cigarettes, smoking weed, smoking cigars even. I've changed up my environment. I became healthier. I went to the gym consistently. I started eating healthier, even though it wasn't perfect. And then it hit me. I was already improving massively compared to the junk that I was before. But I didn't see it that way. I could only see the things that I still sucked at. The negative things. I looked at myself like I was a failure. And it got me in this vicious circle. Because I saw myself as this failure, I started acting like one. And of course, when you tell yourself that you will never make it, you will never make it. It fucked up my confidence. I basically destroyed the self-belief that I could make it with these negative thoughts. So from that point on, I started to look at things differently. From now on, I would write some positive things about myself too. And when I did fuck up, of course I took the responsibility. But I gave myself positive reinforcement. Like, I know you can do better than this. You are made for success. You have a unique gift. Use it. When I failed, I didn't sit in these failures and try to see myself as someone negative. But I analyzed these failures. I learned what was going wrong. I tried things differently and I forgot about them. Instead of sitting in those failures for days, for weeks even. And this is what you need to do too. You need to see yourself as someone that can do anything. Because you can do anything. You need to create that belief that you can do better than this. That you are made for greatness, because you are. Everyone is unique, everyone has a unique gift. And so there's no way that you cannot be great in that unique gift if you use it. Think about it. Would a goal ever be reachable if you're not believing in it? It is your own thoughts that are stopping you. The battle is internal and you need to fight it every day. Look at things positively. Look at yourself positively. You will see that if you change your self-image, your life will change for the better. Your life will turn around. How, you may ask, how do you do this? How do you create that positive image of yourself that you have been trying to destroy for so long? Well, first of all, if you journal, Write positive things about yourself, positive reinforcements. Like I said, even if you did fuck up, say to yourself, 
I know I can do better than this. I have to do better. It is my duty because I am made for success. Secondly, don't ever try to talk yourself down. Sure, you could be mad at yourself, but never say you're not worthy. Never say that you can't do shit, because you can, if you just believe in it. Another thing is to visualize. Visualize yourself imagining yourself being successful, achieving success as vividly as possible. For example, every morning, 10 minutes every morning, visualize yourself as vividly as possible in a successful situation. No matter where you fucked up, whether you got a rejection from a girl or whether you failed for a test, imagine yourself succeeding in that thing as vividly as possible. What do I mean with vividly? Imagine the smells, the sounds around you, the little details that will make it seem as real as possible. Because if you see it so real, if you see it so vividly, your mind, you will change your mind. Because this success will reflect on your mind. Your mind will think that this success is real, that you are in fact a successful person, that you can do these situations, these things successfully. So that's what you need to do. You need to re Wire your mind, reshape it, turn it around 180 degrees and you will see that your life has great things in store for you. Good luck.